The tool selection on the main menu allows you to customize the settings of your golf buddy unit. Touch tools on the main menu to access the list of settings. The first setting on the list is a user profile. The user profile displays your name and your phone number along with the customized picture that you can upload onto your device using the GB Manager program. The second selection allows you to change the unit of measurement that is displayed on your golf buddy. By touching the box, you can switch from yards to meters and vice versa. The next selection allows you to change the language setting for your unit. Touch the current language and a list of languages will appear. If you wish different language, select one from the list and then touch Done. The next setting allows you to adjust the time settings on your unit. The time zone is automatically set by the GPS signal, but you can adjust the GMT by touching the left and right arrows located toward the middle of the screen. Below the time zone setting, there is a selection labeled Button Sound with a check mark next to it. By checking or unchecking this selection, you can turn your button sounds off and on. Turning the button sounds on will enable your unit to make a beeping sound each time you press the button on your unit. Please note that this setting does not apply to the touchscreen, but only for the buttons on the unit itself. The next selection, labeled Screen Timeout, allows you to set a duration of time that your backlight will remain on before dimming out. You have an option to set it to 5, 10, or 15 seconds before the screen will automatically dim out to conserve your battery. For optimal battery life, it is recommended that you set your screen timeout to 5 or 10 seconds. The power management selection will set your unit to automatically power off when it has not been used for a set amount of time. When you are out on the course, it is recommended that you have it set to always on. The adjust brightness selection is a setting that allows you to conserve the battery life on your unit. Touch the bar and slide it left to right to adjust the brightness of the screen. If you are having problems with your touchscreen, the calibration setting allows you to recalibrate it to improve its accuracy. To recalibrate your touchscreen, touch reset and a series of plus signs will appear on the following screen, one at a time, on each corner. Touch each of the plus signs and hold your finger on each one for approximately one second until the next plus sign appears on another corner. Once you have touched all four plus signs, your unit will prompt you to reconfirm the calibration by repeating the same process again. After repeating the process a second time, you will be prompted with a message stating that the calibration is complete. You may then touch OK to complete the recalibration process. The reset GPS setting is mainly used when you are traveling to a new time zone. If you have traveled to a golf course in a different time zone, you will want to reset the GPS to maintain a proper satellite signal. To reset the GPS, touch Reset and then confirm your selection by touching Yes on the following screen that appears. The final setting on the Tools menu shows the system information for your golf buddy. The system information includes the operating system, application, database, and serial number of your unit. If you're having problems with your unit, it is recommended that you check to make sure